We are in Nashville for the Flames' second stop of a four-game road trip, and what better place to talk a little bit of uh, country music than in the Music City with someone who we have just learned is a pretty big country fan. And Jacob Marks from Jacob, how much of a country fan are you, and, and how did you become a country fan? I think it started when uh, when I moved to uh, the U.S. I lived in Rochester my first year. My goalie partner was uh, Tyler Plon. He's a big country guy, so you know we were spending spending some time together and hanging out, and uh, you know. I think he, the only thing he listened to was country, so, you know, I, I had to learn to start liking it, and then, you know, it, it kind of grew on me, and, uh, you know, it's, uh, you know, I'm uh, liking a lot of different kind of music, but, you know, country is, is for sure uh, up there. So I can't imagine there's a big country music culture in Sweden, is there? No, it's more like uh, dance band, it's called. It's like, uh, I would say, the Swedish version of country, but, you know, country... Uh, the North American country country music artists are, are, are blowing up in Sweden as well. So then you come to Calgary and you're probably inundated with country music, right? And the whole kind of culture. Who are some of your favorite artists? My favorite, uh, I would say, the, my favorite one is Johnny Cash and Elvis, and uh, you know a lot of a lot of the old songs. And let's talk about your helmet because that's kind of what sparked this whole idea. You have Johnny Cash all over your helmet. How did that come to be? Uh, well, I've been doing uh, skull mass for a few years now, and I, uh, you know, thought it was uh, was a cool idea. And then obviously we got the Ring of Fire uh, uh, wind song here in Calgary. So you know, I thought uh, they got the Ring of Fire here at the numbers and. Uh, you know, a few photographs with some songs, Rider in the Sky, uh, you know, uh, It Ain't Me, and uh, you know, a few other few other titles here. So Folsom Prison Blues is a, is a good one as well. What is your favorite song? Do you have a favorite? I think Folsom Prison Blues uh, is, uh, is probably my favorite one, yeah. Are you much of a singer? Uh, when no one's listening, yeah, I am. <laughs> what about two-stepping? Uh, I'll dabble a little bit. I, I think after a, a few beverages, I, I think I'm better than I actually am. So I've, uh, I've, I've seen a video of it and, uh, you know, it felt a lot better than it looked. Let's talk about hockey a little bit. Since your uh, injury, your save percentage is up to 936. I mean, you've had a great season overall, but do you feel more dialed in than ever right now? Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I think I feel pretty good. And I think the uh, the work between me and the D and, uh, you know, it's, we're really clicking right now and our, our penalty kill has been on point. So, you know, the goaltending position is, is uh, you know very depending on on the players in front of you and I think the guys uh, have stepped up and played really good and then you know once in a while you got to come up with that extra save and uh, you know uh, we've been getting that uh, the, la the last few games here. Do you feel like you set the tone properly with that uh, win last night against Minnesota? Yeah it was good I mean this, this is a big road trip for us and uh, we got to climb back uh, to, to, to get in the hunt again uh, for, for the playoff and the wildcard position so uh, you know we can't afford to, to lose lose many more games, especially against the, the rival teams. And this road trip is uh, you know it's right in the mix. Thank you for this. Good luck the rest of the way. Yeah, thank you very much.